It is uh, now 11.17. Look who's here. That's, you know, you guys met, that's Peyton. Yeah, Best. and we like to say Hi, Peyton's nice place. Hi, you. honey. <laughs> You're the cutest. <laughs> Great stuff weather-wise, but as you were saying earlier, kind of uh, kind of hazy out there. Just a little bit, and I'm actually going to take you back to school. I have a trivia question for you. Okay. Oh, but if okay. Uh, a little birdie told me correctly, our producers have some video from earlier okay. for us. Because we had a fabulous sunset because of that atmosphere case. And of course, they've gone ahead and, you know, shown off just the beauty of it for us. This is from our very own CSU camera. And because of the atmospheric smoke overhead, the sunrises and sunsets look a little bit more vibrant. So they actually pick up tones of orange, pink, as well as some red in there, too. So if you happen to snap a picture, it's going to look like this for the next couple of days. So you have ample opportunity. You'll still need the sunglasses, but remember the trivia question I told you about? Here it is, because I want you to think about the last time we had rain in Cleveland. Have you been doing a rain dance for a while? I think you have, because the last time we've had rain was back May 20th. And if you're doing the math, maybe in your head, you know, I told you I was going to send you back to school. That would be... 16 days. I'll go back because that was pretty quick. The last time we had rain obviously was then May 20th, but that was just over half an inch. So we have been bone dry ever since. And then going forward, looking for the next couple of days, we don't have a chance. In fact, we have a fire risk in place tomorrow. So avoid open burning. We've got dry ground as well as dry air overhead. So an elevated potential for fire hazards is on uh, board for tomorrow too. Unfortunately, that's something we have to talk about because we have had such a lack of rainfall. And also in my first weather at the beginning of the hour, I told you about the fact that our temperatures did not boost a little bit further than what we were hoping for because of the atmospheric smoke. We only topped at 71 degrees. Our average high this time of the year is at about 77. We've cooled. Obviously, the sun has set, even though we did have that haze around. We're back in the 50s all across Northeast Ohio. Some of you will continue to slide by a few degrees before we hit sunrise tomorrow, but check out our neighbors to the west, Chicago to Louisville, down to Memphis, even Atlanta. They're in the 70s right now. Minneapolis, not far off from 80 degrees. And it's after 11 o'clock, folks, if you, you haven't checked the clocks here in a second. We are still bone dry. Things are very comfortable. If you haven't already, maybe open up the windows, let some of that free AC take over. We actually have a cold front that's going to push south. And as it does so, we keep that northerly wind. So we keep with the chance of that haze for the next couple of days. You have to look back off to the north and east to see a system that's been stuck there. Boston is one of those spots that is stuck with temperatures in the 50s and 60s, and that's not going to let up for them as we aren't going to let up from the milky sky. We added a few clouds overhead. We'll stay in the 50s overnight, but we join back into the 60s tomorrow morning. And tomorrow on the hour in your natural design mark forecast, our high temperature for the day is close to 70 degrees again. That is unseasonably cool by about 5 to almost 10 degrees. We will see a little sunshine, but once again, the atmospheric haze will still take over. And as Russ Mitchell likes to call it, that would be veiled sunshine. Our next chance for rain is not until Sunday. Here goes that front pushing south. And as it does so, it allows for another system to make its way closer to us. Our next rain chance knocks on our doorstep by Sunday. Right now, it still looks relatively low. In your Union Home Mortgage Extended Forecast, 70s through Friday, 80 by Saturday. Saturday, and we keep with the trend of low rain for at least the next 10 days in your exclusive Union Home Mortgage forecast, guys. Okay, Peyton, thanks a lot.